today I'm just going to show you how to put the tighter drawers, the little stop here that goes in at the back, it sits in back here to stop the drawers from falling out the car. So first things first, you take off this top section, so you take all these four things off here, which are these bad boys, and then you take off these individual screws the whole way around. And there's eight of them all together. Put those aside, just like mine. Put it out of the way. And then we get into bump stops here at the back, which on mine, there is no pre-drilled hole through the carpet. So I was a little bit confused as to what was going on, but around the back. So like I said, mine doesn't have any holes. So pretty much you're just gonna come around the back, find where those two holes are sitting. And they're pretty much on this one anyways, is on the corners, so sitting in about here somewhere. So I'm just going to drill out the carpet. Alright, so I've kind of made two little holes. One's there and one's here, you can kind of see it, right in the corner there. Alright, so this is just a little bit hard to film with two hands. Hopefully you can see that. So, I've already lost the bump stop. So this, like I was saying, sits on the outer side, sits facing like this, and you put your, perfect, so I'll chuck it in the back there, it's pretty much going to sit flat on the track on the outside, and then you just, it's super simple, like you'll feel your way through it, but you just tighten up one, I've already lost another screw, or a bolt even. And then you chuck the corner one in, this one's in behind the corner piece. And then you just tighten them up. And that's it there. Easy to install once you know what's happening. So it hits the bearing there obviously. And now, the drawer doesn't fall out. After that, you just put it all back together. So something I would definitely recommend while you're putting the top of this back on, you may as well chuck some form of Loctite in on it while you're doing it. This is a removable one, this is the one I'm using, just I don't know, in case in the future you might want to take the top off for some reason. That's another form you can use. So all back together now, the drawer doesn't fall out, so they're doing their job in there. So hopefully that was helpful to someone, and I'll see you guys in the next one.